G'day trainers, welcome back to some more Poke Arc Survival Evolved. On the last episode, we finally did it. We summoned and conquered the first Origin creature. So we got the Origin Raptor, we had to cheese him a little bit. Kind of cheese him, I guess we took advantage of game mechanics. And we built a little bit of a trap, trapped him in it where he couldn't hurt us. And we could definitely hurt him. Uh, but what's next? Obviously next, we want to jump on and start taking out as many of these Origin creatures as we can. But, something happened while I left the game running, and... So I left the game running, and I was out farming, so I wanted to get a bunch of Trank Darts, or Trank Arrows, uh, Trank Bullets. And this happened, that's right. Our best boy, our most powerful and fiercely loyal companion, Charizard, died. I don't know how, I, he clearly didn't starve, look at all the meat that was on his body, um, but that means we don't really have anything to, to fight with anymore, everything else, like Mrs. Blair's Aids 178, Mega Blastoise, uh, who, by the way, we are about to name after one of the subscribers here on the channel, so quickly change his name, Mork is our new Mega Blastoise. Uh, and I think by default, he might now be the only powerful Pokemon we have left, because I have no idea what's happened to Alolan Raichu, um, at all. Let's quickly go grab something to eat, and then kind of head out, because we, we need somebody new. Uh, we haven't got any cooked meat, and that's sad, because our Charizard used to cook meat for us. We're just gonna bite the bullet, and we're gonna eat a bunch of this raw prime meat. It'll hurt our health, but... Hey, it'll increase our hunger. Well, increase our satiation. Decrease our hunger? Something like that. Alright. Let's go jump on this char... Oh. Let's go jump on this Charizard. I don't quite remember. Wh Wait, what? Oh, okay. Oh, he is unconscious. <laughs> okay, return to Ultra Ball. Let's go heal him, and then we'll be able to. All right, and here is our level 1,249 Charizard. Significantly weaker than our old friend. But, for now, the best flying option we have... Wait, where's Sato? And Calvin? Oh, we must have been raided if they're gone too. Oh, no! Oh, alright, we have to be on the lookout for others as well. Alright, trainers, it is almost morning. I'm going to go see if we can find a powerful Charizard to help us in our quest against the Origin Creatures. I'll see you soon. Look at this massive bad boy we have just found. An Omega Reaper. Level 2,700. Hundred and he aggroes from so far away. Uh, no, I'm not even going to risk it because I do think he will take this guy out with no issues whatsoever. Uh, there's a Charmander. What level is that? Nope, can't see. That's right. We don't want to waste our time in a Charmander. We... Whoa. Is that a... Ah, it's just a, just a Scorpion. Uh, we need to find ourselves some new fighters. A level 3,000 Fero. Now, that could be an option. We haven't caught a Fero yet. Uh, what else, though? What else? What else? What else? That's that same level 3,000. Uh, a level 200 Sand Slash. Sorry, buddy. You are just a... <gasps> There's a Charizard. Level 3,400. He. Yes, he could be the one we are looking for. So, you know what? <gasps> Wait. We are going to have to... Try and defend ourselves first. Because we've got... Oh, that Fero too. I don't know how much damage Fero do. So, just want to be safe. This uh, this Fero, uh, this Raptor is making a fool out of us. There we go. We got him. Uh, and we do need to be careful though. Because of all these down here. Maybe we can quickly clear them out. And as a matter of fact, that's what we are going to do. Yes. While we... Oh! Big guy. While we did lose our... Uh, I guess our primary fighting force, we are still more than capable of handling almost anything on this map. As long as it's not Origin or Primal, uh, or one of those sort of specialty 
creatures like the baboon ferrex or the demonics we should be fine guys like uh most of these guys we can one shot there we go so is that another one or is that a reaper oh my god it was a rock drake i think yeah it was a rock drake all right guys we have just located another charizard uh because we lost the last one this one is level 3700 uh the only issue is he is by one of these big guys and i can only really describe them as well terror oh hello charizard's head what is it called a wild female uh callisto the what the former huntress hunter regardless that's cool uh was that it that was the 3700 there yep all right so let's get rid of this indominus and done cool oh no we're stuck inside the indominus all right uh land move away now only 42k torpor i do not know how much damage or how much torpor these new ones do it seems to be a lot though Woo! A lot of damage. All right. Oh, sorry. No, <laughs> no, what am I doing? I am on so much fire. Ah, oh, there. There, there, there. All right. Terrible shooting. Why am I such a bad shot? There's another one. We're almost there. It's actually going to... Actually, he'll probably start running soon. We really gotta... Oh, I didn't reload! <laughs> right, he's... That dragon tail ain't getting... Me, boy! Alright. He's gonna run, though, for sure. There he goes. All right, where did he land? Let's get a better higher view. Keep an eye out for that Charizard. Where is he? Where is he? Is that him in the ground? It is. All right. That can go away. Let's make sure we've got some Pokeballs equipped. Oh, <gasps> We brought none. Oh no, how much? What do I need to craft them? <laughs> Flint, metal, and tinto berries. Uh, this is weird. Where are all of our Pokeballs? We had plenty. All right. Ultra. There's no way we don't have enough. Not in our base. We have a huge base. We can only make 28? What is it we're missing? Uh, it'd be the flint. Alright. Craft all. Alright. Last remote location. Let's head back. We are back. We were able to craft up a bunch of Ultra Balls. Well, actually, as a matter of fact, we're still crafting it. Let's get him out of here first. Uh, again very scary area uh i just want this capture to happen nicely quickly and pokeball go come on a three percent oh wait we can damage him damage him to make it uh better <laughs> i feel like we're doing less damage than we used to maybe i messed around with the damage multipliers trying to make uh the origin battles more fair <laughs> okay but we're doing about 1700 one more. There we go. Even though I can't see him. Pokeball, go! No! Go! Alright, so I've got to get his wing as he flies in. That is ridiculous. Oh, we had a 26% chance, though. Alright. Wait for that debuff time to drop. Oh, I thought we were about to crash then. Uh, oh. Yeah, I don't know what's going on today. Everything seems to be running a bit less than optimal uh, go 
Come on. Alright, 24% chance. Look, mathematically, within the next four Pokeballs, we should get it. <laughs> uh, I, I I know that's not how that works. <laughs> no! Oh, this is ridiculous. Now! What's the matter, trainer? Oh, it's taunting me. Alright, 26% chance. Wait for that debuff again. Okay. Now! It's going up, though. It's going up. I'm calling it. Next, next Ultra Ball, we're getting it. Waiting for that debuff. Come on. Now. Oh, I was about to start cheering. I genuinely thought that was it. <laughs> oh, almost. Almost, almost, almost. All right. Go. Ultra Ball. Uh, no. All right. Uh, we're getting closer, though. We're going to get it. We're going to get it. All right. Go. While we're waiting, guys, has anyone been watching Obi-Wan Kenobi? Yo, it is good. It is so good. The casting has been on point, man. Uh, like, the, the young actor, they got to portray uh, a young Princess Leia. Spot on, man. Go Ultra Ball. Yes! We got him! We got him, got him, got him! Excellent! Alright! Let's bring this char- No. No. We're gonna lose him if we do that. Let's just see if we can find anything else worthwhile around here. Alright guys, we'll take a little bit of a look and I'll be- I'll be back. Actually, you know what? I'm thinking I do want to try to befriend a tribe. Not to- the way I said it before was to take advantage of their resources or materials. Um, I just kind of want some friends on the island. Uh, I mean, they wouldn't let you do it if you shouldn't. The only thing is I don't like having to then command them. I feel like that's a bit... I don't know, man. I, I don't really like that part. But the idea of having allies, I don't think they'll be able to help us with anything. Except maybe materials. But by this point, that was a big jump. <laughs> By this point, we don't really need help with materials. There isn't really a lot we don't have. Uh, unless we start going into, like, tech. And even then, we'd have to befriend a pretty high-level tribe. And we have... We have made enemies of most of the high-level tribes that we've found. Uh, but what else? Everything seems real bare, right? Like, I feel like there is no way... I'm looking at what the this recording looks like as it's happening. There is no way this looks like it's going in at 60 FPS. Uh, what's that? That is a 1800 Charmeleon. Okay. Oh, a pack of Raptors. Uh, bunch of Compies. Let's take them real quick. Die. 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 Die, 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 die. Uh, I do think, based off past experiences, we do need a newer Lolan Raichu. Uh, a Lolan Raichu was an absolute beast when he was helping us take out that base when he took out almost single-handedly look look <laughs> blastoise was there too but all of that damage man that was really our alolan raichu and i i want another one to to kind of honor his memory because i don't know where he went maybe we will have to go check out actually what you can do i think with the awesome teleporter mod you can put like awesome tracking chips in your uh, dinosaur, and I don't see why they wouldn't work for your Pokemon as well. That way, if you do lose them, you can just teleport them back to you. Alright, we might do that as well. Oh my god! What the heck is that? A forest titan. And a forest wyvern. Oh my god, I wonder if those things will aggro onto me. That ill. Oh no, don't look at me like that. Don't look at me. Wow. Cool. I love seeing the sort of creatures you get out here. Uh, and we've still got this guy from before hanging around. That, uh, was that that former female hunter? Or huntress? <gasps> what were those wings? You guys saw that, right? Oh. 
Man, arc physics has got to be some of the most wacky physics. Oh, what? Oh, what are, what are those down there? Oh, oh, okay. This thing must summon forest wyverns. That is terrifying. Oh no. Oh, and this is bad because I'm starving too. Uh, oh, and they got so much more health than they normally do. Oh, all right. Looks like we're stuck doing this. We definitely need to increase our, uh, <laughs> increase our melee, man. We need to get a better pike. And we can do that at our upgrade station. All right. Day, 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 day. Oh, I need to see what that is. That thing is so bright. Uh, wow. Wild female. Wait, what? A Horus, king of the storms, as in like. As in, like, the Egyptian god Horus? What? We... Wow, what's down here? We have got gods in our Ark game. <laughs> wow, okay. That takes it to a whole new level. What was... Was that Horus? Look at it. Oh, hello. Oh, it took out a 3200 Charizard. <laughs> Uh, with no issues, apparently. Sets creatures that hit it on fire. What a cool beast. I wish we were doing just a no... Uh, nope. I wish we were doing just a normal arc playthrough. Uh, because I would love to try to tame that bad boy. Uh, 2300 Pidgeotto. No, we know Pidgeotos aren't the best battlers. They can... Great support. Uh, especially with that Wind Cutter they've got. Uh, because that thing, at a high level... Is that a shiny Charmander? Hello? Do we try to catch that just for the... Because it's a shiny? I think so. There we go. Let's see if we can catch him. Little shiny boy. Hi. Go a trouble. Cool. We got ourselves a shiny Charmander. He won't be used in battle, but maybe he can work as sort of just base defense, maybe? Alright guys, we have found another Charizard, level 3600, and we're going to try to catch this one too. So, boop! Oh, he, he took off fast. Now, we don't have any Charizard to back us up that we're going to use. Uh, except for that one we just caught, but he would not oh, be under Pokeball protection if we brought him out right now. Which means if he died, he dies. Oh, All right, we got him again. We're at least shooting better this time. Our accuracy seems to have gone up. Oh, and as soon as I say that, we miss. Uh, there we go. Ah, good luck, Charizard. Oh, oh no, no, no! Oh no! Run! Run! No, we are not losing him. Oh, come on. No. Oh, come on. We can mountain goat. <laughs> come on, come on. Uh, no. No. Oh, come on. There we are. We're making distance. Alright, maybe he's gone this way. Let's hope he's gone this way and collapsed. Uh, please. He was our big boy. The only thing that would have made him better is if he had been female. Uh, that way we got a powerful male and female and we can give another go at breeding. Alright guys, we found it again. Flying around like it has no issues in the world. Oh. Uh, that should be hitting. Oh, there we go. All right, it's aggroed on us again. Is it just going to fall? It might just fall this time. I thought it aggroed on us. Maybe we should wait. Oh, no. Now we don't know. 
it's 100% just going to fall. There is nothing we can do about that. Uh, except hope that we find it before uh, something much more dangerous does. Knowing my luck, it's fallen on that giant Omega Reaper. Because I believe that was around this area too. Wait, there it is. Yep. Oh, look at that torpor. One more bullet will do it. There it goes. Now we just need... Oh, it fell so far away. Man, what's going on with this game? It just looks like it's crashing non... Or it looks like it's going to crash non-stop today. I mean, on the best of days, it's not a great working game. But today just seems to be real messed up. All right, guys, here we are. We have found Charizard. We're just struggling to get up to it to actually do a bit of damage. That's all right. Oh, come on. We'll hit its tail. <laughs> Uh, until we can get it down low enough to help increase our odds. Come on, keep going. We're getting there, still doing 1,700. Couple more hits. Couple more. One more. Boom. All right, all right. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Wow, you can't... Oh, it's because I'm so far up, jeez. All right, go Ultra Ball. All right. No, Charizard, come back. Oh, no. Oh, wow. Well, will that kill him? <gasps> no. Oh, man. Go, Ultra Ball. Oh, so close. 30%. All right. That debuff is going to go down again. I reckon after this, we probably go back to base. Uh... We might take one last quick look around, but I don't think there's going to be much else out here at the moment. Uh, maybe we can find that Alolan Raichu that sits around the beaches. That one that's, uh, I think, 1900. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. You do. You get like a less chance of catching it if you hit it during the debuff time. It goes down like 10% or something. I don't know if that 10% sticks for the rest of the game either. Like for the rest of this uh, attempt. Definitely goes slower, though. Come on. Go, Ultra Ball. Ah. All right. Again, 25% chance is not bad. Uh, okay. The debuff time looks like it is back to normal. That's good. It's good for us. Go, Ultra Ball. Come on, Charizard. You're mine. You're mine next time. Oh, we gotta do this before some of this, like, those gods appear. Alrighty. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. We got this. No, go Ultra Ball. Yes, yes, excellent. We've got another one. Oh, good day. We are rebuilding the forces today. Uh, if only it was female. Uh, all right, we've still got nine Ultra Balls left. Maybe we do see if we can... What was all that lighting? All right, guys, so far we have gotten... It does say three here. I'm scared on who the third one is. But we have got our first Charizard. Excellent. He's come out at 3,882. A lot, a lot lower than I thought he was going to. Uh, we have got, oh, the shiny Charmander. I forgot about, oh, he's not shiny anymore. And what did this Charizard come out at? Big boy. Three, three, seven, six, four. Still not a lot, but that's okay. Let's take this guy out for a little bit of a ride. Actually, what we can do, and what we should do, let's give him some meat because we are starving and he will cook meat for us and he will do it lovingly. So let's let him do that. We'll take a quick look around and see if we can find something to catch with this last 
nine Ultra Balls. Oh my, we have got an Apex Rex down on our beach. <gasps> and there was a level 2300 Raichu we could have gotten. But he killed it. Sh oh, hello, base. But yeah, an Apex Rex is down here. That is insane. Look at these guys too. They are built right into the side of the base. You know what? These are going to be the guys that we befriend, I think. Uh, they have at least got ghillie gear, because that Apex Rex has killed a bunch of them. Uh, well, they're out here still. Uh, oh, what is this one at? Level 1800. Uh, I think we can get a little bit better than that. Uh, we got some more guys out here. They're probably from the Fabled guys. Yep. This was a bad... This is where I was starting to build an arena to fight the origin creatures. But, you know, work in progress. <gasps> oh, no. I didn't give him Pokeball protection. Did he die? Oh, no. What hit me so damn hard? Oh, no. Why is everything... Why is this happening to me? Is there like an origin around? Because origins can make other animal, oh, other dinos uh, aggro on you very, very easily. Normally we do not face this sort of aggro. Oh, what a really cool looking Volonosaur, man. Uh, just an Indominus Rex. Okay. Let's get back to base real quick before he sees us. Alright, let's see how that went. Is he here? Oh, okay, he's still alive. He's still alive. That's good. Uh, let's go back. Let's grab the other one. We'll, we'll heal them up. Don't worry. We're not just going to leave them. We will heal them. But, let's grab this guy. They do not deal much damage, man. They deal so little damage. Uh, I think I might have played with the modifiers too much. And we've got another base up here. More elemental guys. That's pretty cool. Wow, someone is doing so much damage. What is that? That is... Uh... Wow, that... What is it? These guys are strong. We need to befriend them, otherwise they could kill us. Look at that, showing he's an enemy too. Nearly a million health, this tamed creature for these guys have got. I don't like that they are so close to our base. They've even got a tamed griffin. Oh my god, is that a light griffin? They have got so much here. It is actually very concerning. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Alright, I tried messing with the wrong creature, apparently. An Alpha Brachio who completely messed my Charizard up. What was that? What the heck, man? Oh, get out of here, Radita. Oh, and those Crystal Dynonicus. What was that explosion? There's nothing here. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh, this base is so much more dangerous than I remember. Oh, sorry, this place is so much more dangerous than I remember. Ah, uh, I guess it's been a while since I've come out just barefoot though. No! No! Oh, there are so many. Oh, that is terrifying. Oh, hello, little Squirtle. No! He nearly killed me. <laughs> oh, oh my god, is that an... Oh, what is that? That's so big for a Megalodon. Oh my god, that's what that explosion was. Oh, don't blow me up. Don't blow me up. Why did that Blastoise have red eyes? <laughs> Why is everything killing me today? 
Oh. Oh my. All right. Maybe we can ride in here. Jump, jump, son. Get in. Oh. Oh. Okay. We are out. There is another primal out here. How crazy is that? And a demonic Mesopithecus over there. Those things are probably my favorite thing in this. Oh, they're all blowing things up. There's two of them. And who is this? Oh my God, the horror. Who is this guy? The primal spikers. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I want to be your friend. Are you a friend? You don't have anything you want? You want rare flowers? Don't we all? I just like used all my rare flowers. Uh, are these guys primal spikers? No. Who are the primal spikers then? Oh man. All right. We are going to do a quick jump in the water and then teleport out. Hopefully it slows down whoever's behind us. Is this another one? Who are these guys? Are they going to attack me? No, I want to be your friend. Your friend. Please let me be your friend. Nope. What are you into? Angler gel? I don't have angler gel. <gasps> oh no, what was that? No, I wanted that. Um. Oh, do I have no ultra balls left? No. <laughs> this is not going my way. Uh, who are these guys? They're the Celestial Woolly Socks. I hate the names so much. Uh, hey, what do you need? What do you want to be friends? Uh, you're the Angler Gel guy. Let's get in close. What do you want? Gasoline. Gas. I've got plenty of. Alright, so this guy is back to being our pet. What level? Only 100, man. We can't... We can't do it with a level 100. Is that a flying Ekans? <laughs> oh, buddy, I gotcha. I got... Alright, so they are healed up. Let's see what we are going to need for some more Origin spawns. So we have already done the Origin Raptor. I think just the next easiest should be the Origin Kano, right? But we need a generic artifact. We knew we were going to need it. And we're really going to need a stronger team. Well, maybe not even a team. Because I actually don't have an issue if maybe we sort of trap it again. Uh, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we'll tr we'll try to do the spawner one. The spawner? <laughs> we'll try to do the Kano. Or spawn the Kano on our roof. Uh, that could be the most fun. It, it, look, if it wrecks our base, we'll build back. Um, but we're going to need some more generic artifacts. So we've got a couple options. If we get lucky enough and find a creature wandering around, I think he's called Artifacto the Great and you kill him. He usually has like five or six artifacts on him. Uh, but you can't just bank on that because I don't know where he is, man. Um, so we do need to kind of just see where he's at. And if we don't see him, oh my, is that a giant... Uh, is that a rock or is that a giant gorilla? I'm going to say it's a rock. It's a rock. Uh, <laughs> and I guess we'll just have to go spawn some more caves like we said we would. All right, trainers. We added two more massive Charizard to our team today because we lost our big hitter. Now, I think that they might still be too low level. Now, I've got a couple options. One, I can just increase the difficulty of the game even further, which will increase everyone's levels. And that means we keep getting something stupid, like level 7,000, 8,000 creatures spawning. Or we can increase our own multipliers uh, and some of the multipliers of the uh, of the space spawn or the wild dinos. That way it doesn't become too unfair. Um, I'm going to think that one over and we will probably have to do that in the next episode. But enjoy a quick round 
of Get the Artifact. All right, so we have come back to that generic cave because it was the quickest and closest one I knew of. And here we've got that Forest Titan. Let's just quickly run through, hopefully decimate anything down here. And, oh no, am I going to crash? No. And uh, hopefully just grab ourselves a real quick... Wow, that is... I'm losing so many frames. And grab ourselves a real quick artifact. Okay. Can I just try and run past them? Because... Uh, for myself, I've increased their level too much. And look, they are a bit tough to beat. Actually, you know what? Go! Go! Whistle aggress aggressive. Charizard! Wait. Whistle aggressive. Come on, dude. Come on, guys. Go. Help. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, my God. Is that a Ranio as well? It is. That is terrifying. Guys, what are you doing? Why aren't you helping? Where are they? Come on. What is happening? All I can... E oh, no. What are my... What are my Pokemon doing? No. This is... Oh, what am I... Where am I stout? Where am I stout? What am I... Why can't I... Where? Charizard! Oi! Come on, guys. No. Come on. There's too much health. Are you not? Oh my god, there are spiders too. Don't give me that right now. What would I need a Megalodon information about in a cave? No. <laughs> this is... This is so terrifying. Oh... Come on. Oh, what is going on? I can't. I can't. Oh. Can I get out? Oh, God, I hope so. The hell was that? Bloody hell. I got swarmed. Like, absolutely swarmed. And my Charizard did absolutely nothing. That does not sound fair to me. All right. Let's see. If I pop in... This Ascendant Spike, can I upgrade it? No, why not? I cannot, really. That is very unfortunate. Oh, no. I'm an idiot. I wasn't whistling for them to attack the target. I was, I was using a different whistle. All right, that's on me. I'm going to try and get back in there. And maybe, just maybe, we can call them. And hopefully they attack. Uh, or not. It didn't teleport me. What the heck? Last remote location. Oh, no. All right. I guess I'll see you back over there. All right. We are getting absolutely reamed by this forest titan. What? The game glitched. Something happened. I couldn't get into the cave. Here it is. All right. Oh, are my guys dealing damage to it? Go for it, boys! Oh, that hurt. No! Come on, my Charizards! Whistling for me! Come on, guys. Oh my god! Help me with the Thera. Oi, on ya. Attack the big boy. Attack the big guy. I can... Oh, 118,000. What? Oh, I don't know if they're going to do that. Oh. Where are they? There they are. Why are they just flying around not attacking? So I don't know what my Charizard are doing, man. He's doing damage to... Wait, are they? They are doing some damage to him. Okay. I don't like that he's just sort of floating to me. That is incredibly eerie and terrifying. 
Right. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Get out of here, Firo. Come on, guys. Wait. Can I just? No. Whistle to me. Don't crash. Good. Come on, guys. Just follow me. Follow me. Oh, come on. Wait, can I? Yeah, take out the onyx. What? Hey, let me go. What is happening? I'm, I'm literally stuck in... Oh. Oh, cool, 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 cool. All right, Charizard, you can take that though, guys, right? Oh, no. Can I just sort of hide here in the cave and command him to battle? Look at it. <gasps> P jumped on us. Oh, boy. Come on, guys. Oh, if I was on one of them, I could take that thing out. It's only 400,000 health. How do I? Oh, wait, what's in the Pokeball? Oh, okay. Oh, great. I'm I'm ensnared again. Excellent. Oh, come on, mate. Oh, come on. Now it's doing damage. Stop. All right. Back to following me. Come on. If I can get on your back, we might be able to do this. If you're the one that had a few melee levels pumped into you. All right, come on. Let's get to the top of this cliff. Well, is it a cliff? Oh, no. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Come on. Oh, he, he is being taken out, though. Just do it. Do it, man. Where is he? Where is... Oh, my! Wow, he does not hit very hard at all. I am wearing very good armor, though. Where is my Charizard, though? Like... Like, where is he? <gasps> there he is! Come on, bud! Get him! Alright, no, he's back to hitting hard. <laughs> there, 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 that should have been it. That should have been enough. Wait, I don't use a bowler anymore. <laughs> Could you imagine if that thing worked on a bowl? Uh, if a bowler worked on that thing? Oh, no. No, 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 not again. Oh. Another 10 seconds. All right. Come on. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. We could end this by taking out a forest titan, though. It doesn't look like it's aggroing. Oh. I mean, we could go back. Teleport back to our base and pick up a Charizard. And as a matter of fact, that's what we're going to do. Oh, no. Oh. Bye, big guy. All right. We are back. Let's fly around. We're going for this Forest Titan's head. Let's do this. How much damage can I do in one hit? Oh. All right. <laughs> no idea. Oh, it gets so laggy. Right, 114k. I feel like we can one-shot that, right? Come on. Oh, no. Like, we're putting damage on it, right? It's definitely putting damage on us. Uh, Maybe we just can't see the damage bubbles coming through and maybe it just receives a uh, reduced damage oh there we go oh eat him eat him yo we did it we did it that is we just took out a forest titan. Excellent. 
Oh, okay. So the <laughs> the strategy with those big ones is just get inside them and kill them. It's the old uh, Ant Man crawls into Thanos's butt theory. <laughs> just get inside of them and blow them up. Uh, I have no idea where my other Charizard is though. Uh, which sucks because I... there he is. Hey, hello. Oh, don't crash now. Okay, buddy, you might be stronger, but you have got a lot to learn. All right, trainers, that is it. We've added two new Charizard to the ranks, not as high level as the one that helped us take out the Origin Raptor, but hopefully with a little bit of training, just as dependable. Uh, that I'm going to do a little bit off screen. And the most surprising part, we ended up getting trapped by, and then defeating the Forest Titan, the big boy himself. That was exciting. It was scary, but it was good. Uh, and we picked ourselves up another artifact. So on the next episode, we are going to be fighting the Origin Kano. I'll see you then.